may her soul rest in peace so guys this is an update kuhusu the lady who was killed pale resambo at air uh, bnb at trm drive and uh, it has been kwamba the family walikuwa wame receive a demand to pay a ransom of 500,000 uh, Kenya shillings. Na um, guys uh, before we proceed, wacha nikuulize in case you here, make sure you hit that subscribe button. So the family of the 20 year old lady who has been identified as, Re as Rita uh, Waeni Mwendo uh, the family imeza kusema kwamba was a student at Jomo Kenyatta University of Science and Technology and uh, wanasema kwamba on um, the tragic day yani hiyo day aliuliwa uh, the father received a text message through Rita's phone na hiyo message ilikuwa ina demand 500,000 uh, Kenya shillings within 24 uh, hours ndiyo aweze kukua released and upon receiving the message, the family waka report the matter to the DCI. Na investigation ikaanza. Uh, the family also shared that two more messages demanding the ransom was sent. But they did not receive any further details about the ransom. Furthermore, additional demands zikaendelea kukuja even after the, the ma, even, if, even after her murder. The family stated that... Um, the family believes that their daughter was lured by her killer who attempted to extort money from them even after taking her life. Now, Waliosa could describe Rita as an intelligent, a smart young woman uh, who possessed a youthful spirit. She was known to her kindness, laughter, and ability to brighten any room she enters. So, uh, Inasemekana kwamba Rita before aweze kwenda kufika pale ku meet her, her, the killer eh inasemekana walikuwa na chat via Instagram na Rita alikuwa anaonekana through the kulingana na the chats Rita anaonekana alikuwa anakataa the demands of this guy ku meet na alikuwa anam question anamuuliza why do you want to meet ama alikuwa anataka kujua the intentions of the guy and the guy blushed off uh, this lady na akaendelea kum kumseduce na kujaribu kum 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 nini to make sure I understand that there's nothing that's going to happen so ali blush off the the messages zenye Rita alikuwa amemwandikia ku demand uh, why does he want to meet her so wakaendelea ku chat through the instagram Na inasemekana kwamba the lady akakaa ni kama ako hesitant to meet the guy and uh, but the guy akaendelea tu kum, 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 kumongelesha na ina, inakaa ni kwamba the guy alikuwa bado here in the country but uh, ikafika mahali akaambia Rita ya kwamba uh, he will be traveling outside the, outside the country so kama ako hesitant to meet they will meet when he comes back and I think that's where Rita akakuwa na na nini akakuwa na convinced that this guy is traveling outside the country so wacha tu ni meet kabla aende so before he left the home aliacha ameambia aunt yake pale sio kimao that ameenda ku meet the cousin na the conversation pale Instagram ikaendelea ya kwamba mpaka alipofika walipokaribia TRM aliwe aliandika an update akawaambia akasema mahali amefika akaambua akifika TRM drive ashuke na wakati alipofika TRM drive akaweza kuandikia this guy na the guy aka respond akamwambia pia mpaka venye alikuwa amevalia the white shoes na that's when now walienda kumi so inasemekana kwamba the main suspect is a Nigerian uh, who is suspected to who allegedly murdered the 20 year old na um, alikuwa tu ana demand hiyo 500,000 shillings but from there the parents hawaku receive any additional information uh, so uh, throughout the conversation uh, the woman questioned the suspect about his intentions expressing concerns about her safety shockingly the suspect brushed of her inquiries na the family wameza ku release information na wakaweza ku identify the the the, the, the nini 
the girl after waliendelea ku search during the day after reporting the incident to the DCI na um, that uh, what happened so guys uh, what I'll urge you guys uh, kwa sababu watu wengi wamekuwa wakisikia about dating uh, ama online dating na watu wengi sana wanakuja online especially TikTok na this is something that maybe is misleading ladies unapata kwamba watu wengi wanakuja wanasema how they met the uh, partner online wanakuja ku converse but watu wengi wenye wameshapitia mambo magumu hawakujangi online kusema ya, ambao waliyoyapata wali, wali, wali kwa sababu gani kwa sababu unapata labda mtu wako very shameful hataki kuja kujionyeshana aonyeshane venye kiri, kilimramba pale after alienda ku meet maybe a certain person na uh, at some point unapata he eh, the, the kind of killings that you to make experience the two kind of the, the, the two killings are stale ya stale to ahu na ya richa wa, eh, waeni they are very similar na kulingana na the previous report ya DCI ni kwamba eh, yule jamaa aliyua stale to ahu pia alikuwa na the same same intentions za ku make sure ame, ame invite a lady na amemtumia mpaka pesa anamu invite to a place then akienda pale anaanza ku demand pesa na mkoshua ama mko aware that there are several cases zenye ziliweza kujitokeza as the case of Scarlett Wahu watu wakiconfess kwamba waliweza kuwa wamepatana na huyo jamaa na alikuwa na amewafanyia mambo so uh, this is a warning to the ladies that in case uh, in case unaenda ku meet a stranger there are some precautions maybe unafaa ku take hata usikubali kwenda kuingia kwa room na mtu na hamjuani is a stranger make sure kwanza hata mmejuana eventually maybe utaweza kujua intentions zake but at some point kuna watu wanaweza kuwa wamejificha kabisa hata wezi jua but uh, eh, ni it's a warning that ujue all that glitters is not gold watu wengi sana wanataka ku hii kutajirika ya haraka haraka and that's why unaona uh, eh, most ladies akiona tu akisikia tu mahali kuna pesa kichwa inaenda hewa ya ni kukimbilia tu ni kukimbilia tu hata utaki kujua the next cause of action ama the 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 the, the consequences so long as wewe umesikia kuna pesa ladies uh, hawataki kujua kama kuna magonjwa ama nini but so long as umesikia tu kuna pesa you are there uh, one time so it's a, it's a high time watu wa take their time na pia Eh, mujitunge watu wenye mna meet kwa sababu eh, even today today there is another case a lady mwenye ameweza kukua uh, uh, kupatikana pale Eroiro akiwa ametupa uh, kwa shamba fulani na inasemekana alikuwa anaonekana the lady was struggled na at the scene uh, kumeza kupatikana muguka na samjugu karanga so that lady pia ameuliwa na investigation inaendelea na tutazidi kupata more information na tutazidi ku keep Uh, you updated so thank you so much for watching uh, in case you're new here make sure you subscribe thank you